Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. me. I'll make sure that most of your models have gotten a pay raise. I just need to deal with a few things first, alright? Alright, call me back later. Bye! Ugh. Why am I the only one that has to deal with all their shit? Oh, hey! I didn't see you come in. So... How was your little, you know, secret mission that I put you on? You get any good details about Alistair or anybody there at that stupid hotel? Great! I love to hear that! So, give me all the deets. Let me hear it. Uh-huh. Right, yeah, I already know about the porn star demon. I already know about him. Tell me more about Alistair. Okay, he's got more people with him. And how many more people does he have? Oh, that's not so bad. I can hire like 17 more people than he has now. Okay, yeah, so what? That's not my problem. That human themselves, they just fell through a portal. Obviously, they're gonna get fixed up and go right back to Earth. <laughs> What did you just say? So, you're telling me that that human who the idiots call Hell's Wanderer decided to stay in Hell and decided to stay in the hotel that Alistair is in, and also the princess of hell is running. Interesting. Well, there must be something that they're doing to keep them there. Or it might be Alistair's doing. I don't know, some sort of spell of some th kind, or maybe a shield? I mean, I saw them use a shield the last time the angels tried to exterminate a lot of people. So it wouldn't be the last thing that he thinks about. Hmm. I have an idea. Listen. I know you've only been working here for a few weeks now. But I have another important job for you. You know my good old friend Valentino, right? Yeah, I sent you up to fix one of his light fixtures. Yeah, so I'm going to have you work for him for a little bit. And since... That little porn star is still wor living, not working, living at that hotel. I want you to get real close with them. And once you do, have them give a little bit more detail about what's going on inside of that hotel. 
because I want to know every single little thing that's going on inside of there. Well, that's simple. I'm having you work with Valentino because he's the closest we can get to Angel Dust because he still has him under contract. He's not going anywhere, even if he does move a circle or two away. Well, I mean, he's still not in. He's still in the pride circle. So, I mean, he's not really going anywhere now, is he? Right. So, that's why I'm having you going to Val. <laughs> why aren't you going to Velvet? Well, that's simple. Velvet doesn't really work with male models, or doesn't really work with males at all. She usually works with girls, and usually her outfits usually are going to either Valentino or the female models. You know how she works. Yeah, so that's why you're going to Valentino for a little bit. Trust me, I have a few plans already set out for that stupid little hotel. I have a few people that I can call. And, well, since you know the location of the hotel as well... Well, I mean, I know the location of the hotel as well. But, Valentino doesn't know where the hotel is is and plus he's kind of bad with uh, directions so if push comes to shove you and Valentino can go to the hotel and then we can get more inside information and we might cause a little bit more chaos than the princess of hell can handle with Val there you get what I'm trying to say here? Great! So, your mission is going to be... Good! So you do listen! I'm glad I hired you. Uh-huh. Oh, trust me, you're still under contract with me. But working with Valentino, that's just more of an extra gig. And plus, I guess I'll pay you extra since you are working with another clientele. Does that work for you? Alrighty then. So, how about you go up to Val's room, talk with him for a little bit, and then you can, uh, I don't know, have the day off. I'm feeling very, uh, happy today. So, I guess you get special treatment of some sort. But, if I call your phone, you better be back here, otherwise I'll replace you. You got it? Good. Now, please, step out of my office. <laughs> this plan is going to be perfect. Once I get Val inside of that fucking hotel, I'm going to make sure that that little princess's life is going to be the worst thing that they have ever experienced. <laughs> oh, this is going to be such a fun thing to watch over these cameras. <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I sent them up there. Look, Val, listen. We're going to get lots of information from them. And plus, you don't know where the hotel is. 
So, sending my little thing up there to work with you for a few days isn't going to hurt you. No, they can't be in your films. Because I said so. They still work for me. They don't work for you. Well, I mean, they are working for you just for a few days so we can get information about Alistair and the Princess of Hell and their stupid fucking hotel. And plus... I'll make sure that you can get real close to Angel because my little bitch thing is knowing of the location of the hotel. So when push comes to shove, if we don't get enough information, you and my employer are going to the hotel. Got it? Good. Now stop calling my phone and bitching about it! <sighs> you wait, Alistair. Because we are coming for you. <laughs>